Kamala Harris also made history as not only the first woman vice president-elect, but also the first woman of color to hold the job. Um, Cindy, what do you think this means to women and really more importantly, little girls everywhere? Well, it signals to, to little girls like my newest granddaughter uh, that, they, that they can do anything. Yes, you can be vice president. Yes, you can be president. That should have been something that should have been our moniker all along, and unfortunately, it wasn't. Uh, I just am so excited about having Kamala there. She, I know her. She's a wonderful woman. She, she really works on human rights issues, which I love. Um, and and I, I think we're, as a country, we're very lucky to have her. Yes, we are, for sure. And I think that, God forbid, if anything should happen, she can take over in a heartbeat because she's really smart. Um, mm -hmm. So senators who hitch their wagon to Trump, and they know who they are, they ended up doing really well on Tuesday, including Mitch McConnell and Lindsey Graham. And it continues, the sycophancy. What do you make of those high-profile wins? Well, again, um, uh, my... <laughs> Those those folks. I mean, all politics is local. So always re that was always what we had to remind ourselves. It's all local, and in those cases, that their local communities and their states felt that they were the right one to, to sit in that position. Um, it it all in the yeah. end, you know, it all it'll it'll all wash out because I believe that that soon to be President Biden uh, will be the kind of person that will work across the aisle and bring these people into the fold so that everyone has a voice a rational voice and a civil voice with regards to legislating and, and, and making important decisions for this country. Well, I hope so. But, you know, Arizona did flip one Senate seat from red to blue with voters choosing Democrat Mark Kelly. He was an exceptional, exceptional candidate. What does that win mean, though, for your state? What, is it, what does it say about the way Arizona is heading? It was kind of, kind of well, edging Arizona into purple. I think it's starting to look a little blue. Yes, I, our state has changed a great deal. There's an, obviously an influx of newer, you know, young people that are coming in from across the, the nation, uh, and that influences the voter. And, it, you know, in years past, this is one thing that people seem to forget, and I'm talking about years and years and years ago, um, most Arizonans were Democrats but voted Republican. And, and so I think, I think what we're seeing is a, is a change in the cycle, certainly a change in, in the face of Arizona. And the fact that the Latino community has a great influence now with regards to the future of not just Maricopa County, but Arizona. Now, before we go, we obviously need a grandma update on baby Liberty. How is our newest little view baby and how is Megan doing? Oh, she's doing, Megan's doing great. And little Liberty is just the best. I obviously have not been able to hold her yet because of COVID, but I, I FaceTime and do all kinds of things so I can see her. She's glorious. She really is. I'm just so, we're so blessed to have her. She's adorable. That the last time you she's were, so, I know she's just the yes, cutest. Yes, she is. It's really, really cute. Is. And the last time. <laughs> Last time you were here, we, we talked about the passing of Roberta McCain, and she's going to be laid to rest at Arlington uh, mm -hmm. today. So we're sending big hugs to your family. Mm -hmm. And thank you again for coming by this morning to talk to us. Mm -hmm. Cindy McCain, you can are I, everything say, we I, want you to be. It's oh, fabulous. Thank you. And can I say to all of you, your input and your face uh, with regards to, to the Biden campaign, and I know you weren't campaigning, but your, your thoughtful talking of the issues really helped out, I think helped Americans understand what was going on. So I want to thank all of you for being a part of this campaign as well. Oh, wow. Thank you. Thank you.